And now for everyone's favorite part of animation, the math. This step is crucial if you want your animation to actually take as long as the script needs, which you do. Otherwise, you'll finish animating, and when you try to record audio, you'll find that you need to rush through your script in order to keep pace with the animation. Or worse, need to go back and reanimate parts of it. Now, your story reel shows you how long you'll spend on each shot. It's your timing guide. If you have a 30-second short, you and I both know it will take 300 photos to get there. This is a photo, this is a photo, this is a photo, etc. But how do you know how long to spend on each of the scenes you drew in your split script for each shot? For that, you need to open up your story reel on your smartphone and time out how long you're on every shot. I'm able to open it up in the photo app on my iPhone. Rather than hitting play, I just use my finger to drag at the playhead. So in the example I recorded, the first shot goes till two seconds in. Let me write that down in the notes section. Then the next shot goes until three seconds in. And then the next shot goes until four seconds in. If you're not able to drag at the playhead and see the times, just count it out. Hit play, one Mississippi, two Mississippi, pause. That shot is two seconds. Play again, one Mississippi, pause. That shot is one second, etc. So let's convert those timings into numbers of photographs. We're going to take 10 photos for every second of footage. So if the first shot lasts until two seconds in, it means I need to snap 20 photos. Why? Because two seconds times 10 photos per second is 20 photos. The next shot is one second long, so that means I'm going to have to take 10 photographs. One second times 10 is 10 photographs. It's important to do this for every shot. When you add them up, you should get right around 300 photos you'll have to take for your 30 second piece. All right, time everything out and Believe it or not, in the next video, we actually start animating.